In this example, we're graphing fractions on a number line. I want to divide the given line into units of length 1 sixth, label each tick mark, and then plot and label the given numbers. So let's provide alternate forms for these numbers if we can. So I'm going to start with the halfway point here and then put two marks and then two marks. That should give me 1, 6, 2, 6, 3, 6, 4, 6, 5, 6. That gives me my equally spaced tick marks of length 1, 6. I'm going to do the same thing over here and put my smaller ones here. Then it says to label each tick mark. So here's 1 over 6, 2 over 6, 3 over 6, 4 over 6, 5 over 6, and notice that 1 is equivalent to 6 over 6. This is 7 over 6, 8 over 6, 9 over 6, 10 over 6, and 11 over 6, and 12 over 6 is 2. And I can also write the mixed numbers for these would be 1 and 1 sixth, 1 and 2 sixth, 1 and 3 sixth, 1 and 4 sixth, 1 and 5 sixth. This is starting to get a little messy. I could reduce some of these, but I'm going to leave that for now. Same thing over here, but just so you can see the, the sixth, counting by sixth. So let's see where each of our numbers are. 0 is the same thing as 0 over 6, so 0 is an equivalent form to 0 over 6, or an alternate form. 2 over 6 is here, so I'm going to label that. Let's go ahead and put a dot there. We'll put a dot here for 0. I can reduce 2 over 6. 2 and 6 have a common factor of 2. That reduces to 1 third, so there's an alternate form. 5 over 6 is here. We'll give that a dot. 6 over 6 is here and we already know that's equivalent to 1. We did that before so we'll leave that. 9 over 6 is here. I have that as 1 and 3 6. I can also write that as 1 and 1 half as another alternate form. And so there you have your number line divided into 6 and all the points plotted and labeled.